really do it, I'm so nervous. Because even if it shuts off all my small brand, like, stuff, this is way worth it all. Because this is going to grow me like crazy, right? I don't know if y'all were guessing right. Jen North, baby. You're looking at the newest athlete, y'all. I can't be looking at my contract and stuff, though, but... Shoot! Shoot! Damn, I'm good looking. This is huge, y'all. Guys, I am legit so overwhelmed and so thankful for all of you guys right now. All of you guys watching, like, when I first started bodybuilding, when I first started all this, I did not think, like, it'd be anything of it. I didn't think, I didn't be where I'm at today. I'm not saying, like, I'm crazy, but I'm just so proud of where I'm at. But never satisfied, but you can be proud. But, guys, I'm just so stoked. I just said with Jed North, one of the biggest clothing companies there is right now, and it's like... There's so much room to grow with them that I'm just super stoked for what's to come. Like, I'm so high on life, I got goosebumps. And, like, if it weren't for you guys, I really, I wouldn't be where I'm at. I wouldn't be able to be doing what I'm doing. So, like, truly from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys. You guys are the ones that make my dreams a reality by supporting me. So, like, each and every one of you, thank you. Even if, like, we have never talked before, I appreciate the heck out of you guys. I try, always try to get back to everyone's messages. Because you guys, it's like, you guys are investing time into me. You're taking time to watch my video. So I just want to say thank you so freaking much. I have so much business ideas and so much content coming. I just can't wait for the future, guys. Because once this prep's over, it's all business money moves modeling, guys. I'm so freaking excited. Uh, nice little stash update, baby. I can shave. I could use a D-shave. So what's up, guys? <laughs> this is the vlog. JoJo. JoJo and me, yo, we about to kill it with some legs today. This is what I do. I literally, I'll give them the camera. I have somebody do a random vlog test to see if they even know what I say. It's like, if you don't know my intro, do you guys even, like, watch my videos? It's literally, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Hit him with that. What is going on, guys? Welcome back back to the vlog. <laughs> We're about to hit legs today. Yeah. And I'm I'm really pumped because Joe fucking kills me every time we hit legs. So <laughs> you dig? Nah. But um, yeah, Avery's here in the background. As you guys see, you got those monstrous quads. Let's see what they were there. Yay! Time to get to Juicy! Look at the garbage just sitting in the background. I hate that. But yeah, we're gonna have to go pick up my boy Tony, and then I think later we're gonna go get my body fat tested at Complete Nutrition. My coach wants to see where I'm at, so I'm gonna go do that. I'm probably sitting around like eight and a half, and I need, be, need to be like sub five, and I got like four more weeks. So, but quick update, I'm dying, I feel like shit, I hate my life, and yeah, let's get it. We're about to head to the gym now, but I just wanted to jump on this topic because I get this a lot and often asked basically so like when you first start you need to create opportunity yourself nothing's just handed to you for example for me what I do I'm a fitness model so if I want to shoot with the top photographers I don't think the top photographers are just gonna come to me like that I have to do the work myself prove myself you have to work for you have to prove to them who you are you got to show them why they want to shoot you why do you deserve to be shot by one of the best photographers in the world for example Anything in life, if you want to have a, an awesome physique, you got to go to the gym consistency day in and day out. Even when you don't want to, this is all a mental game. If your mind isn't there, your body won't be. Let's go champ. Come on. It's easy. 
Moi. Come on, Chief. can see I'm trying to pull off this new look I'm trying to rock that mustache look at that stash update I'm looking ratchet that's the funny part though and the bandana so we got a bandana and a stash but guys it is so freaking cold in my house like they had us turn the temperature to like 65 degrees because there was like natural fire starting I don't even understand at all but I am so freaking cold but guys we're about to hit 40k so I'm stoked for that. Thank you guys for the crazy support. I'm about to go hit a chest workout. I did some of the leg workout as you guys just saw. That was some of the leg workout for yesterday. I didn't really get to record much. We had to leave due to, due to some things. But all is good now. So guys, hope everyone's having an amazing day. Happy Sunday. Make sure you guys go to church because I'm going to this new church. It's called the Radiant Church and it's so dope. They get me so fired up and gassed up. It gots me like on my knees praising. It's super dope. So recently my vlog clips have been kind of scattered and they haven't really been in order. So if you guys could please right now go down below and leave a topic on videos you guys want to see. Because since I'm uploading twice a week, I kind of just been like filming a little bit every day, a little bit randomly of my workouts and putting videos together like that. But I want to dedicate each video to an actual title so it's not just like a vlog every time so we can hit different parts of the search engine so this way it can reach more of a variety of audience than just my following base. So um, with that being said, I guess I will just address this topic right now and talk about a little about prep and how I'm feeling because guys, this a lot of people it really isn't what it seems like most people just see the beginning and the after product when it comes to prep and no one really sees the how they feel what they're actually going through or what really is happening so I think that's what I'm gonna touch up on now guys because you guys know I post twice a day I keep it freaking real on the gram and everywhere I do I don't really try to I don't put out a fake image what do you see is what you get that's the my favorite quote that I've heard about me they said, what you see is what you get from me. And that's pretty much, I keep it real. I don't lie to you guys. I tell you guys how it is, tell you guys what I do, what I take. So, yeah. So, honestly, right now, I want to give up, but I'm not going to because I'm like, my mind's trained. But, like, just for example, today, like, during the gym, I was having the worst workout ever. I couldn't get a pump to save my life. And I just wanted to stop, and I felt horrible. So, I called my coach, and I'm like, Yo, I feel like crap, I want to refeed, blah, blah, blah. Just being complaining and like, he gave in a little, but then I ended the call, I'm like, I realized why I'm doing this and I'm doing it not just for myself, I'm doing this to show everyone that you can do it too. So like when you see all these top influencers, all these people with a shredded, amazing physique, I'm doing this to show you guys that no matter who you are, you can do it too. Like you're, if you're standing next to someone with like 2 million followers that's a celebrity, you can be that same person. That's what people don't get. Like, what you put in is what you get out. And I'm just trying to keep it real and show people that you can do anything you want. You can do anything you want in life. All the opportunity is there. Camera, social media, with everything nowadays, you can truly do anything you want. And you can create your own destiny and your own success. 
just through a lens like this right now. Hi, I'm, you guys are watching me. I've created success just through my own personal branding and that's what you have to do nowadays. So excuses are super irrelevant nowadays. But like I said, back to the bodybuilding topic, um, how I feel, I feel horrible. So if you guys ever wanna do a show, you guys gotta be ready to do what it takes. You guys gotta be ready to shut down personal life, hanging out with friends, people that don't push you and motivate you. Cause honestly, I don't hang out with anyone. I do the same exact thing every single day. And if those are true friends, they'll still be there for you. They'll be there at the end. So it's like, don't worry about the people that are celebrating dancing with you when you win. Go hang out with the people that are there for you during the whole time. But yeah, I don't know. I have super mixed emotions right now. I'm always going to do this just because I love the sport. And I'm willing to do what it takes. Most won't. I will. I'm going to actually get that tattooed on my arm after prep along with finishing my car. But guys, I'm just going to wrap it up here. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys did, please be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Show your grandma. Honestly, send this video to a few friends. If you guys screenshot my vlog and post it on your Instagram story, I'll repost it onto mine just to show some love. If you guys can do that, re tell that to a friend. Thank you guys. It's been your boy. See you guys Wednesday. Yeah.